Okay. So the next one is asking us what so what is a a plus zero? Okay. So first let's recall the definition for this. So a theorem definition is that if two angles and a non-included side of one triangle are congruent to other angles and a non-included side of a second triangle, then the triangle are congruent. I mean, the, then the both, uh, then the two triangles are congruent. So let's write down the keyword. So if two angles and a non included oops, side of one triangle are congruent to two angles. and a non-included side of a second triangle. Then we can conclude that triangles are congruent. Mm -hmm. So let's use a Example to explain this. So let's say I got two triangles right here. So this is ABC. Okay. And I also have another triangle. Let's call this uh, A bar, B bar, C bar. Okay. And um, So in the figure about sigma AB and sigma um, A bar B bar are not included sides of the two triangles. So first let, let's write that down. So sigma AB and sigma A bar B bar are Non included sides of two triangles. Okay. Oops, so let's, let's label this. Okay. So we have the um, following condition which are and oops angle ABC and angle A bar B bar C bar are congruent okay and angle ACB and angle a bar C bar B bar are congruent. And lastly, we have sigma AB and sigma A bar B bar are congruent. So we can have. Two triangles ABC and A bar B bar C bar are congruent. Mm -hmm. 
by AAS property or CAS theory. Okay. Yep. So for oops. So for the first sentence it's referring to the first A. And the second sentence is referred to our second A, which is stand for angle. And the last sentence is stand for S, which is stand for size. So therefore, we have our AAS theorem. Okay. Yeah. So I think that's all we got for this question. Let's leave a comment. Solution is correct. Thank you.